I watch these um, these series, uh, like on Netflix. You'll have season one and season two. Let's let's talk Ozark, whatever. Right. And, and so there's multiple story arcs going on over time. Is there not? I mean, we're learning about internal struggles on four yes. or five characters yes. all through the season. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and so that's a that that is a, that's a very experienced writer, and it's it's talented. And so what we recommend is when you're first writing, don't try something that hard, mm-hmm. right? Because you have to know that's a multi point of view story, and you have to know all of your subplots, and and it's 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 hard to do skillfully. I mean, Game of Thrones is a prime example of that, mm-hmm. where obviously very popular, did it well, but. There's point of views all over the place um, that, you know, if, you, if you're a novice writer, you start with really no more than five to seven. You can control that, mm-hmm. but it takes significant talent to get character depth for that many points of view. And, um, you know, I love the Game of Thrones ones because some of those people, you like, you really don't want them to succeed, right? They're just terrible. And yeah. so you just really feel like, come on, fall off the cliff, right? Yes. And the other ones, you're like, oh, run, <laughs> right? It gets you going. And even though they flip point of view, point of view, point of view, they start at the right moment. They, they, you know what that character wants. You know what the consequences are if they don't get it. Or if they do get it, you know those consequences are horrible for a character you care about. And so you're fully, fully physically engaged in the story because it's so well done. I think what they did really well was they killed Ned right early. And it's like, wait a minute, we've just got invested. Mm -hmm. We're buying into his. Right. And all of a sudden he's he's dead. And then they did it again. At least this unexpected. And I'm going... This is unusual, it's different. It hasn't been this way in a lot of stories. So that's a really important point, is when you have a significant event occur, that's gonna set the scene for how your story is gonna be. It has to be early in the story. Um, So that, you know, to make it super easy. So if you're writing a funny book, you need to have humor in the opening scene. Mm -hmm. If you're writing multiple points of view, you need to change them quickly. You can't write three quarters of a book and then change the point of view because your reader goes, what? So by killing Ned right away, it set you up for all bets are off. You have no idea what's gonna happen. You think you can guess, but you just don't know. And so it keeps you on the edge of suspense because they did it so early. They made you get invested in that character and you liked him and you wanted him to succeed and you never thought his head was going to roll. And then they did it. And now you're set for the rest of the series that the unexpected will happen. And so you're completely caught up. It was super smart. Amazing ride. Thanks for watching these golden nuggets. And as a reward, I got another big fat golden nugget just for you. I wrote this book for you to help you get your act together online so you can grow your business better. You're searching, you want to learn. This is a great book. Grab the book, grow your business.